Will it work? Oh, look at that. It work. Hey, everyone. Atlas the Architect here. Let's get into the video. I'm going to show everyone how to build a uh, Atlas Cannon. All right. Basically, uh, we're going to make use of uh, crystal sulfide. You can find this on any planet that has water. All right. And uh, it's that thing going off behind me over there. Now keep in mind that there are a few things we have to do before we actually go ahead and start building the cannon over the crystal sulfide. One we have to take into account, it's got to be in shallow water. And I'll talk to you a little bit about that later. Another is it's got to be perfectly centered. See I have this little wall just to let you guys see how it's right over top of this thing. It's the reason why we do this, right? Because we want to maximize and optimize that force that you see launching you skyward and you'll see that in a second all right as of right now we want to talk about how to actually build this thing i wanted to let you know just for measurement purposes i built three walls so we're looking at something two to three walls from the surface would be your idea target range uh you know from where we are back it up for you so you could see that's how it looks little ramp going out to it perfect okay so uh, now what we're going to do is uh, test our platform out okay uh, instead of doing what I want to do build this wall here we're going to exit out go into the build menu and uh, pay attention to this floor see how this floor walking around solid but over here I'm swimming there's a, still a floor right there but I'm swimming that's what you're looking for that's what you need all right that's what i like to call the swim state that see that that's a swim state let's test this out all right whoop got to get on the platform let me get up there am i there uh yeah i'm there all right swim state you see me wait in the water the screen's shaking that means it's ready to go look at that so that's basically what it looks like and this is just a primitive version of a base that uh, one way you could implement, you know, using the sulfide cannons is, you know, build the sky base. That's what I like to do. I build the sky base and uh, have that cannon launch you up there, drop back down. I would let you know that it does take a tad bit of your health. So if you're a newbie, make sure you got some hazard protection. OK, and uh, all right, let's build some stuff here. So you're going to start with a wall, then you're going to reverse wire glitch, then you're going to connect it to another light panel, and we're going to, no, I'm just joking, we're just going to build the box right here. <laughs> no, I thought I was going to get all technical with you. We're just going to build a little box. Nice and sweet and simple here. I'm looking around, it's going to spend a lot of my time with these videos, just looking for parts, even though they're right in front of my face. All right, so I got my door here. The cannon went off. Going to give that a little bit of time to reset. That's another thing I'd like to let you guys know is that uh, you know it does take a few seconds to reset. So while we're waiting, that's going to bug me. <laughs> Just a little hole in the floor. I don't know if it's going to bug me. And now we wait. And shaking. Where is it? Come on, baby. Boom. There it is. Dag, that was a bigger one with the last time. Seems as though since I built the walls around that thing, I got like a, a, a more of a contained and more of a energetic reaction. Hmm. Okay, now let's have some fun. What we're gonna do now is uh grab uh let's see where's that chair? There it is the chair menu. And not the little spinny one, but the one that you actually sit in. I'll put that Right about there. It's about in the center of that thing. This is why I like to call it a little porta potty. Okay, this is called the porta potty, explosive porta potty. You know, and uh, you have to do your thing. So I would give you some privacy, but there's no privacy here. See, I peek at you right through those little. Get ready. Oh my gut! Boom! There it is. Now this is crazy. Okay. Um. I'll just say, if you don't exit out this animation, like, you know, stand up from the chair, you will continue to go into space and continue into space. And uh, your hazard protection is going to go down. 
just make sure you have a lot of hazard protection and uh, a lot of refill if you want to go ahead and go all the way up to space just saying but that's a possibility yeah <clears throat> still going still going I don't know. Maybe I should fast forward now on my way back down. <laughs> you see what does to your hazard protection automatically takes you right out. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and speed it up for you. And we're back. And yes, that's how it's done. All right. You can either put the chair down or not. Both ways are cool. Both ways are fun to play around with and you can also build around them or base your build around them you know base your base around them <laughs> either way yeah you have now learned how to construct an atlas cannon on your own i encourage you to build the base incorporating the atlas cannon into that base if you want you might as well let me uh go ahead and pay that base a visit i wouldn't mind I have plenty of bases of my own to show off that incorporates the Atlas Cannon. So it's a good thing to stay tuned to this channel. It's a brand new channel, but subscribing is a good idea if you want to see some more of this. It's hitting that like button is always appreciated as well. Until next time, Atlas out.